we're all champions. It's just a matter of who is the biggest champion of that weekend. The very first hole, hole one on the course. Um, I'm not pressing my luck trying to get a birdie if I'm out of position, but that's one hole in particular where the, the foot's not gonna necessarily be on the gas, especially being the first hole of the round. Uh, you don't, you're not winning anything right then and there. Learning what it meant and what position I was in after 54 holes of regulation, this may not be over yet. Like, I, this is a, 18's a very birdieable hole. I gave the high fives to my card mates and I walked right over to my caddy. I Okay, now you can show me scores. You're in the lead by one. Really? That's when we were just like, well, now we become spectators. Oh, looks like advantage slitter. It's good schlit. It's a 4th of July. I'm not going to forget and most certainly not Dan. The adrenaline that was going through my body was so intense that it actually made me stop and go, oh, holy shit, I do love this stuff. Like this is genuinely, I'm screaming right now and it is like primal. I was friggin' terrified. <laughs> I, was, I was shaking. Like my heart was beating through my chest. We were all on that tee box with him as he threw down the gauntlet that is the right side gap of 13. That's the closest thing we know to that situation of like, going into a playoff against a really good player at a high level event for a decent amount of money. Like that's kind of a pinnacle for a lot of these guys that are playing today. I'll never take for granted at all because that doesn't happen every single day. That doesn't happen every weekend. Even the best players in the world are not going to be at that top spot every weekend, getting their name chanted, you know, being, being the talk of the town essentially. Yeah. Yeah. 